this is posting on the days of Minecraft Pokemon. Can I capture two shiny legendary Pokemon within 100 days? Or how about taking on the secret pink special Pokemon challenge? Make sure you watch till the end to find out. And shout out to all my fans for commenting these Pokemon ideas. And if you enjoyed this video, consider subscribing and enabling all notifications. On days 1301 to 1310, I got my friends and we traveled to the roof forest biome. And during midnight, we went looking for Rotom. This Pokemon could transform into six different forms. Oh, we found Mistreamus! Let's go! I'm pretty sure Mistreamus is a pretty rare Pokemon, so finding it is pretty cool. Let's go, buddy! Yo, Philip! Guess what we just caught, bro? We caught a Mistreamus! He's like, dude, what are you doing, bro? <laughs> yes, I do have a chameleon on my shoulder. His name is Philip. It's currently midnight time and we still can't find him, so I have another plan. And so I traveled to the Woodlands Mansion. And inside here, Rotoms have a higher chance of spawning. And along the way, I found some new structures and got attacked by Vexes. All right, we're here. JV, Connor, are you guys ready? Woohoo! I'm ready yeah. for So, the thing is, I think there's still some, like, mob spawning here. I can't... Oh, yeah, they're here. There okay, is? does anyone have any weapons? Yo, I, I don't have uh, any yeah, weapons. Yeah, I got a ruby sword. I Go! Sword. I don't like <laughs> Tornadus! You gotta do something, my guy. Yo, Phillip's like, oh, nah, bro, that. I'm not trying to play with these dudes. I only have a pickaxe, and I gotta... Oh, Okay, he's trying to kill me. He's trying to kill me, bro. Okay. No, he's trying to kill, kill me. I'm good. Off. Keep your eyes open for Rotom. Yup. Yo, oh, Chase. Got him. Man, I did not come prepared for this. Oh, wait, they seem to be pretty friendly. Oh, oh never mind. They're not friendly. They are not no. friendly. Just look for Rotom. It's some kind of like a lightning looking Pokemon. It's like, it's like a little uh, light bulb or something. I don't know how to describe him. Guys? Just what? Yeah. Yo, I actually think I found him. No, you did it. There's no way you found him before me. Yeah. Hold on. I'm trying to kill this dude. He's really yeah, so it's, it's, a, it's apparently a rare spawn inside the Woodlands Mansion. Now, if you're in the regular Root Forest biome, he doesn't spawn as much now. What is all this? Yeah, Jamie, where are you? Super small. Um, I don't know. I was getting some upstairs, bookshelves. Downstairs, downstairs. What do you mean? I don't know. Upstairs? We're trying to find upstairs? him too. Okay. Yo, we should destroy upstairs? this entire place. Just burn it all down. Burn yeah, that's all what I'm down. doing. I see this chicken. I'm like, oh, my bad. This place is huge and kind of lost. I see your name tags though. Yo, I found a T Pokemon. It's called hey, Sinistee. Yeah, look at this thing. It like pops out. So you... Look, he's right here. Wait, where? Right here. It's a shiny. What? Yo, it's Jamie. No way. No way. Yo. No way. Shiny. Okay. All right. You know what? You gotta keep. Uh, Alright, Jamie, that's gonna be yeah. Jamie's Rotom. I don't know how you managed to find this Pokemon on your first try, but that's that, that's gonna be yours. Now I, now I gotta get my own. Ooh, that, that's ridiculous. Okay, sounds good to me. Bro, what? Are you kidding me? Do you have your shiny gold lures on? I got mine on. I got mine on. I do have mine on, yeah. Hey, Jamie, that's your, fine. Uh, your head is moving. What? Oh, oh, Connor's like, no, nah, I'm just gonna be a savage. Oh, sorry, we got I thought you said we that. still, <laughs> we still need it for the Rotom. I put the place on fire. I put the place on fire. Is this a shiny Litwick? I can't tell. It's not shiny. Never mind. Come here, buddy. Do I have you? I have this guy. So what other Pokemon can we catch inside of here? Oh man, Connor, you're literally putting the whole place on fire. The chicken in here. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. The whole top floor is already on fire. Oh no, that was quick. Hey, your place is catching on fire, and I need to roll him before I die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No, no way. I have an axe! Ah, uh, ah, uh, oh! Okay, let's no, 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 <laughs> Are you kidding me? Okay, everybody to the third floor. Uh, we okay, should also get okay. some toes of a dying because why not? You're like, yes, you better run away, boy. <laughs> ah! 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 I got him. The third floor should be like inside. Oh! Yeah, I think I got it. Too. Jamie! Yes! Oh, you saved my life. Thank you. <laughs> Connor's still burning this entire place down. <laughs> That's how I'm having fun with. Oh I'm just burning the whole place. You are dying oh, today! Yeah, I did it. Wait, no, 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 don't kill me, don't kill me, no, don't kill me, I'm throwing over the No, 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 ah, ah, I'm panicking. I'm not supposed to be, like, fighting things. It's Pokemon. <laughs> Jamie's like, I'm gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna yes, I got it. I got a totem. Oh, wait, I think I just stole it. <laughs> I yeah. stole it. There's one more. I got a totem. 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 Jamie, grab it, grab it, it's right here. Jamie, grab it, hurry. Oh, it's a new Pokemon. It's a new Pokemon, hold on. Uh -oh. Ah, Totem will die, bless up, bless up. I'm alive, I'm alive. I can't see anything, it's nighttime. My mind is really dark. <laughs> I'm catching all these Pokemon. So now we're on the third floor. I'm still looking for a roll and I can't find one. I'm pretty upset. Jamie, I still oh, can't believe you found a shiny right. Rotom. That was yeah, just as crazy. crazy. Yo, you know what's funny? Because I'm pretty sure it was Jamie or Connor that also found that shiny, uh, the, the diamond looking thing. Deonce. Yeah, the shiny Deonce. <laughs> I'm lacking all my shiny look right now. Got him. Oh, no, 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 I should have bought some armor. Oh, hey, my friend, what's up? Ah, no, 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 I'm having the worst time. So we got a couple comments from the previous video, and everyone was asking, Moose, what is up with the new biome? So new biomes means new Pokemon spawning different biomes, including, Philip, your tail's touching me, including legendaries. They spawn in different biomes now. So yes, if you find a Pokemon that spawns underground, it's going to spawn differently in a different biome. It can spawn on top of the thing, or you get the whole entire point. Oh, I hear Pokemon. Oh, I already got this one. So what else are we lacking? Let's see. There's the shiny Rotom, which is pretty much the most insane catch ever. And then 
we got a Lampent. Here's my shiny Deonsi. I got this weird teacup thing, which I'm gonna get to Jamie. And that is it for my Pokemon collection inside the Woods Mansion. Wow, this place is literally fully on fire. Have we even got to the fourth floor yet? Is there, even, is there even a fourth floor? <laughs> and finally, it's midnight again. That means Rotom is gonna spawn. Oh, there's a skunk. Wait, Jamie. What, really? It's a skunk. Look, it kind of smells oh. like you. Oh, I don't have this guy. <laughs> there is a fourth floor. Oh, Promises in the dark. I don't have a Scraggy, apparently. All right, Scraggy, you are gonna be my... Oh, okay, Scraggy, never mind. Yeah, there's a lot of them. I just caught a Solendit as well. And I'm still trying to complete my Poke... Oh, oh shiny, oh, shiny. Shiny, you want it? You can have it, you can have it. Where? It's all you. I already okay. have one. I don't think I have a Cacne yet. Do I have a Cacne? Don't have this guy. Come on, buddy. I have a new strategy. Ow. <laughs> Everybody, pick a floor. I'm gonna pick the last floor. And then, Jamie, you can choose whatever you want. And we're all gonna look in every single bedroom and find a Rotom. I'm looking inside the chicken. Honestly, Please, I, I am upstairs currently. Oh, I thought I actually found a Rotom. No way. I'm not no, even kidding, no. guys. No, kill, kill the Rotom. I'm bad. I'm literally so bad, bro. It's I have to find it. I'm yeah, so disappointed. Find it All the fans are going to be roasting me in the comments like, Moose, Yo, come I'm on, bro. Step your game up. You're losing your luck. I, I oh, I found an Ox Apple. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Finally, I found him. Wow, wh oh, you why found do I have to be the worst? Yo, it's like literally the worst condition ever. Like Pokemon, ah, I'm on fire. Pokemon does not want me catching him. Like the whole entire entrance was just covered in fire. Come on, buddy. Come on, my friend. Here, I'm gonna catch him. Oh, I don't have any like special. No, no, he's on fire. 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 No, 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 no. Jeez, bro. My day just is just not getting any better. <laughs> Philip, what's going on, buddy? What are you doing, Philip? You know, what'd be funny. Philip just like pooped on me. You know, not trying to be weird. Like he just kind of like, pooped on me during video. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's go to Ultra Balls. I'm not about a Master Ball and Rotom. That's gonna be ridiculous. I caught the first one on my first try. This one is just, it's just giving me the worst luck possible. Do we have a Chameleon Pokemon? We do. It's, a, it's, a, I think it's a Kecleon or, 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 or Calcium. <laughs> Calcium. <laughs> Calcium Pokemon. Hi, Philip. All right, Philip. You are gonna be my good luck charm, hopefully. We're gonna catch this Rotom, and if he dies, it's your fault. <laughs> Philip also loves to climb my hair for some reason. I think it's just because it's so poofy. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. Hey, Philip. Okay, so, uh, Philip, listen. You know, in, in front of. This is, this is painful. This is very painful, Philip. Oh, Philip falling. And. <sighs> We got him! I captured a Rotom! Ooh. Let's go! But we're not done just yet. Ow, ow. And now that we're back home, we've got to create a few items. We need a mower, which is the first thing. So we need to create shears. Got the shears. Now we need a hopper. There we go. So two silicones. And that's going to create our lawnmower. Yeah, I'm making lawnmowers. You know how it is. <laughs> we need a full shears just like that. There we go. Okay, I think I already have one. Okay, so I already have the washing machine. All right, I got the mower. So let me grab the washing machine machine out of my room all right and i was even thinking for our house jamie i think we gotta start yeah. decorating this place like actually put like a kitchen a laundry yeah. room and stuff get rid of all these banners <laughs> that banners. you put down <laughs> there's just way too many of them no. wait philip jamie do you even know you have a bedroom here no you see this? look we gifted you a bedroom look I at know, that this is one that i wanted so this is our lawnmower and this is our washing machine now let's go ahead and take out our pokemon so here's what we currently got these are all the pokemon that i've caught well this is actually my rotom and this is jamie's shiny rotom which i really can I have it? Yeah. <laughs> okay, perfect. Then. Look yeah, at this dude. so cool. I've never had a shiny Rotom before. That is so interesting. I like and it. And now, it's cool. here's a regular version too. Check it out. So it's like a little more oh, orange. Yeah. Um, same type of face. Now, if yeah. we go and right click one of these items, I think it actually like, doesn't work. I don't even know. You gotta throw it at it. Oh, it, it did something. Oh, so cool. yeah, it worked. Look. You see? <gasps> Rotom has kidding? transformed. How did that happen? So if you take the Pokemon <gasps> and you throw it at it, it transforms into it. So let's go ahead and oh, I'll trade you the Pokemon real quick and then you okay. can try yourself. Here you go, Jamie. So let me show you how it works, though. Now, there's over six different forms. Now, the form that we had originally, that counts as one of the forms, the regular form. So, Rotom really? currently is, let's see the stats. Electric and a ghost type. You can levitate. Here's the attacks. And it's just the regular nature and huge size. I'm surprised it's actually huge. So, now if we throw it over here, boom. Oh, wait, hold on. Watch, ready? Boom. So now Rotom has transformed into a, ro I think it's called a lawnmower Rotom. Let me, let me check. This is called Rotom Wash. Now, Rotom Wash is a, grass and electric type. That's pretty cool. Now, here's the stats, as you can see. All right, so now if we take the lawnmower, I mean, the lawn, whatever, throw it at the washing machine, now it becomes the refrigerator Rotom, which is also known as what? Rotom. Wait, I got it mixed up. That's Rotom Wash. This is Rotom Mo. I don't know how I mix that up. I'm sorry. So yeah, Rotom Wash. <laughs> I'm it's losing so it, man. Too much Pokemon. Bro. So now it's an electric and a water type. And here's the stats. Wow. And there you go. Now this item, by the way, I mean, this Pokemon move right here, if it was like, you know, Leaf Storm or whatever, it actually changes with the Rotom's form. So let's say it's Leaf Storm. Now it's actually Hydro Pump. Here's the stats. 
And now we gotta make the next one. So we got the washing machine. Now we need the fan. So I think I already have a terracotta block somewhere here. Or I might have a fan. Oh, there you go. It's right there. I got it. I got a fan right here. Let me grab the fan. Now let's put the fan right over here, Jamie. Let me show you real quick. Let's check this out. Yeah. So take a rotom, throw it at it. And now it's a rotom fan. Look at my boys. Fly. Here, try, try it with yours. I want to see how yours look like compared to mine. So that, that, that's a meow. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> now okay, so the rotom fan it. is an electric and flying type. Oh, did you do it? Here, right here. Right, right here. Hit this thing with it. There I you did go. It. Oh, I did it. And there we go. The regular rotom and the shiny form. Pretty cool. Now we still have three more left. What? Really? No way. Yeah, I actually forgot which one they were. <laughs> <laughs> so you take your rotom and you gotta throw it at a furnace. So where's the furnaces? Do we have a. Oh, it's right over here. Boom. Now we have a rotom oh is it working there we go rotom heat Yo, nice what? so this is called a rotom heat it looks like a little stove top or i guess like a microwave and it is a fire and electric type and here's the stats now the fridge oh. where is our fridge right here in my room i don't know why i have a fridge in my room <laughs> boom and now we oh, have a nice. rotom fridge the regular yeah. form and then the shiny form my dude looks so weird look at him <laughs> I, I really can't tell either so now yeah. it's an ice and electric type and here's the stats once again and that completes all the rotom pokemon forms what is going on in my head what is, oh, from days 13 11 to 13 14, I placed down my PC box, then chose the Pokemon Milcery and selected my Pokemon team. The goal was to try Gantam back to Milcery into an alchemy. <laughs> Frog starts with F. What did you say, Jamie? Did you just say frog starts with F? <laughs> what? <laughs> I got a trumpish. Let's go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo, yo, rare Pokemon. Rare Pokemon. Rare Pokemon. Yo, huh? that's gotta be a special Pokemon. Say? That's gotta be it. The snake thing? What is wrong with my, my my internet connection is breaking right now. My internet connection is dying. Yo, hold on a second. No, 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 no. Yo, that's scary. Yeah, that is mine. That is mine. That is mine. That's a you special Pokemon. Sure I don't it. know what it is. It could be a villain. Oh, got him. Is that a villain scene Pokemon? It has to be. It has to be it. What well, is that? Let me know. Why does it look like that? What? Huh? It's definitely gotta be a special one. So it turns out this Arbok over here. It's not an egg, it's an Arbok. <laughs> so this Arbok is supposedly a dark form. I've, I've never heard of that before. Huh? Which I'm pretty surprised. It's it's called a dark form. I'm not sure what kind of a Pokemon that is. I looked it up and it's just kind of like random, I guess. Yo, look at this. It's so cool. I'm riding a snake. No way. Now let's get some levels. I need to get an Alchemy. And Alchemy is the one that has like over, I think, 70 forms or something. That's definitely gonna be one of the goals in this video. Oh, and he just blew himself up. Rip. That thing is so tiny. Look at it. Popping its face out. Look at this dude. And now he's waving. He's like, hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? Hi, buddy. So in the regular Pokemon games, in order to evolve this dude, you gotta do like a weird form or something, like a spin, and then like, you know, do this and that and it just it, you get the point it evolves i'm not even kidding i know it sounds absolutely ridiculous what i'm saying but i'm telling you it's, it's the truth <laughs> oh we haven't caught this guy yet the dust skull so with uh milcery there's only one way to evolve this dude apparently and it's all based off the biome the suite you're holding and the time but the issue is is apparently not a gigantamax form oh wait there is a gigantamax form wait what i think there is one no way i gave it a gigantamax soup so it should have the form now and i can't tell did i catch a pumpkin pokemon Ooh, a shuffle it. Haven't got this one either. And look at the little Puchiana. Hi, buddy. I just got that one too. Yo, first try. Oh, Jamie, catch it. This is a Miss Dreavus. It's it? a very, very rare Pokemon. Make sure you catch one of these guys. And that evolves into another Pokemon. If I give Milcery this sweet show, Milcery your moves. Is that good? That... Dance moves? Yeah. No, no I'm, I'm not kidding. <laughs> this, is a, this is an actual thing. Look, I'm, I'm showing. What do you, oh, what do you think, Milcery? I'm so good. Yeah, you gotta dance in front of it. Ready? Uh, is that how you... Connor, you go. Is that like a slash dance? No, I do can you evolve? Oh. Guys, I'm not tripping. I'm trying to tell you the truth. Okay? Gonna, you, gotta, gonna, you, you have to dance. dance. You have to dance. I'm not good enough for you. I didn't watch the TV screen. Oh, shiny, uh, shiny. Chari, can you fly? Me. Minecraft, can you fly? Hold on, Chari. Oh, oh. oh, oh what is that? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, that's what you get, Connor, for trying to kill him. Oh. It's a shiny, uh, it's a shiny, uh, Meowth. Yay! All right, so now we're better at this. <laughs> so this is the vanilla cream form. Uh, this is the Milcery. <laughs> Here's the strawberry, I mean, the love sweet. Now, we are in the forest biome, and it's daytime, so we have to do this. Ready? Okay, show Milcery your moves. One. Oh, it worked! It oh, worked! You have to spin 360. No way, you spin 360, works? and it does it. There you go. Okay, now there's over, <laughs> I believe, 63 Milcery forms. Jeez, what? that is... Wow. So, yes. Oh, I got something i gotta decorate and there we go Aww. i'm not kidding awesome. jamie i'm telling you this is real
real deal, okay? Nine different biomes that Milsuri can evolve inside of with seven different times and all the moves are the same, which you gotta just spin 360. Now, if you have the shiny form of Milsuri, you can evolve it into like seven different shiny colors in different biomes as well. So yeah, it's gonna be a pretty long challenge, I gotta say. Oh, Zacian spawn. Zacian. Tiny Zacian, tiny Zacian. I have one. I, I don't have my strong shiny one though. I found it, I found it. It's not, not shiny. shiny, it's not shiny. Nope, it's ah, kill it. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make some monies. I'm at $946,000. That's that's a lot of money. And what do we got now? Oh, oh, 950 grand. That was gigantic max alchemy. So watch this. Oh, let's go. Whoa, it's, it's a cake. A giant oh, it's cake. literally a cake. I want Yo, cake right now. Literally like a quadruple layered cake hey. over here with the Pokemon on top. I was at G-Max finale, whatever. Oh, oh. I'm dead. <laughs> My bad. Didn't mean to eat you. I found a shiny. Koopachu. Koopachu? Whoa, Koopachu. whoa, that thing is sick. It's purple. Whoa, it's a purple head? Yeah. Guys, man, you, you gotta breathe a little bit. I got a Koopachu, a shiny one. Yeah, that's so cool. I don't cool, think dude. I even have this guy, do I? Oh, I have him. I have a bear tick. On days 13, 15 to 13, 20, I placed up my PC box and I chose five different fossil Pokemon. The goal was to evolve them and complete the fossil Pokemon forms. Oh, look at these levels. Yo, we have so many levels. And there we go, my boys are level 10 and level 12. It's time for Philip to go to sleep, so everybody say bye to him. Bye, bye, Philip. Hi, bye, bye, Philip. Thanks for coming on our show. <laughs> I've never been a reptile person, but I think that chameleons are the coolest things ever. <laughs> I also want like one of those giant lizard things. The, the, you know the dragons? You know what I'm talking about? Oh, shiny! Yo, I almost missed you. You were kind of like blending in here. A shiny Delmise, dude. Or Delmise, whatever, whatever you would call it. <laughs> dude, that thing looks crazy. Can I? Oh, ah, that was first try. It's only level 15. It shouldn't be that. Nope, nope. Where are you going? Where, 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 where are you going, my guy? Well, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where are you going, my guy? Chill, bro. He was ready to swim away. He's like, nah, I'm out of here. Hit him with an ancient power. Oh, come on. I flinched. Let's get his health a little bit lower. Going in for the Ultra Ball. And I got it. Delmise. There we go. So it's a shiny Pokemon. These are stats. And that's about it. Boom. Let's go. That's pretty cool, I gotta say. I have no space in my shiny box. Where did I put you? I also managed to catch this fish right here and also Corsola. That's the one that we need to defeat and get the levels. Yo, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to win this fight, but I'm gonna try my best. Ooh, this is gonna be a tough one. What if I confuse Ray if he doesn't want shot me? He doesn't want shot me. Oh, it's working. It might be working. Hit him with an Eterna Beam. Ooh. Wow, I barely did any damage. Oh, man. That Kyogre is no joke. Seriously, no. Oh, what happened? Oh. Oh, I have you to good? recharge after the attack. Dang it. I'm having some technical difficulties. This Pokemon is no joke. It says I'm recharging. What do you mean I'm recharging? <laughs> Hit it with a Confuse Ray one more time. Oh, man. The game is glitching out for me. It is not having a good time. Oh, the Poison Tail. I think it's working. I can't even tell if I'm hitting it. Oh, apparently. No, never mind. Shiny Love Disc. Jamie, get in the water. What? There's a Shiny Love Disc right there. Shiny. My game is glitched out. My game no is way, fully no glitched way. out. Okay, okay. <laughs> Yo, I don't know what's happening. I'm not sure what's happening. Is this, okay, I got I to run. Oh, no. My game froze. Oh, I see it. No, come on. <laughs> swim, Jamie. Swim. Jamie, you got this. You got this, Jamie. How do I even swim again? You've been preparing for your whole life for this. What do you mean? How do you swim? Got it. I got him. I got him. Okay, so I'm going to have to close my game out and redo with this thing, but I, I don't know what's going on in my game right now. Hopefully, okay. I can catch this Pokemon. It says waiting. Oh, yeah. My game is glitched out. No. Wait, I got it. Yes. No, you got it. Oh, thank I got God. it for a shot. Okay. All right. Wait, there's another shiny? Wait, where is it? Rice. All I see is shiny dust. A shiny clamp pearl over here. Good. There is a shiny there, but I can't see the shiny Pokemon. Oh, no. It's a shiny. It's a shiny. Wait, wait, wait. wait. I need that too. Hold on. Hold on. I need shiny? <laughs> Yo, get that clamp roll. I, I need that thing. Did you oh, get you it? it? Yeah, on, I have to get it. Shiny, I actually bro. had a goal to get a shiny uh, shelter. Or, no, no, that's not a shelter. I forgot what it's called. Cloister. Cloister. Or does a shelter evolve into a cloister? I don't remember anymore. I made a mistake. A shelter evolves into a cloister. I don't know why I thought a clamp roll or whatever it's called evolves into something else. <laughs> now, I'm still trying to fight this Kyogre. It is... Oh, a Suicune. Suicune's here. Now, for some reason, this thing is so powerful. I do no damage to him at all. Literally nothing. Look at this. What? Got the better goes. And let's get these levels. Unfortunately, the Kyogre was impossible to kill. It, it was literally impossible. <laughs> but with the full team, is doable. So every single fossil Pokemon has to hit at least level 37-ish. And then I can actually evolve it. Woo! Look at this. I got another Nether Star. We can make yet another beacon. Is it a mushroom biome? Yo, check this place out. Look at this. It's like a brown mushroom slash... Oh, what is it? Paris. I don't have a Paris, do I? Oh, I don't have a Paris. I was missing this guy. I have a Pokedex. Literally. Look what I found. This is a, uh, a Phalanx. I don't think I have this guy. Oh, no. I, I definitely don't. So, I believe he's like the new Gen 8 Pokemon. I think so. Now, Blissey is still the only way to get proper levels in the game, of course, because Blissey just like absolutely gives you so much 
XP when you kill it. It has even a chance in the back. Let's see if we're dead. Kill it. This should pump us up to at least level 26 or 25. And let's see if anything has evolved yet. As my game just completely glitches out. <laughs> my boy's got some pretty solid attacks. Not bad. Level 31. We're so close. I really don't remember how to evolve half this Pokemon though. I think one of them needs a water stone or a leaf stone. I can't tell. We'll keep crunch. And let's get rid of the rest. Oh, there we go. Kratidos. Yes, Kratidos is evolving into a Rampart. Rampardos? Is that what it's called? Rampardos? I call it the middle little T-Rex. No, it's, it kind of reminds me of a, a Paki dinosaur. I forgot the full name of it. It's like a Pachyosaurus. Yeah, it definitely looks very, very similar. Now, a shiny form of this Pokemon is also really cool. Ooh, level 35. Got a Skull of Darkness. I don't think I even have this guy, right? No, I don't. And now we're sitting at 70% completion of the Pokedex. So I've seen 687 and I've captured 631. Now, there's a few that we're missing, which are super simple to get, as you can see. Like, for example, I don't even have this guy. Why don't I have a person? <laughs> or a Magnemite, a Slowbro, and a Slowpoke. So lots of Pokemon that have completely passed by and haven't caught. Well, let me know in the comment section down below which Pokemon I should catch next. Apparently, I have two wings and two heads. What? This is called the Oasis Biome. Definitely a uh, very interesting looking place. For I sure. would totally love to have one of these palm trees. Can we grab one for our place? Yeah, let's grab one. Have a nice. Yeah, let's, let's, let's definitely like put this somewhere around our beach biome. Jamie, you're on tree duty. Let's go. All right, so I'm officially at at level 37, so I should have one more Pokemon evolving. And let's see. Oh, Arkin is evolving into an Archeops. Archeops? Archeops? Ooh, wait. Ay, yeah, whoa. So Archin has evolved into an... Oh, wait. Tortuga oh. is also evolving. I wonder how many people are triggered by me pronouncing these names wrong. <laughs> Look at this dude. So we got a giant turtle, and we also have a, uh, I guess, a pterodactyl. Well, not a pterodactyl. I don't know what you want to call this thing. What does this, this thing remind right you here? of? This has yeah. such cool colors. I don't think I've ever seen this color combo before. No, it's really, really cool, especially the shiny form, too. Now, Amina is the only one that evolves. I think, oh, wait, Amara at level 39 evolves at nighttime. There we go, level 30. Oh, come on, it's still not enough. Anyways, I'm gonna use my rare candy on one of these dudes right here. Watch this. Okay. Now we got ourselves oh, that one is so another cute, one. Though. Yeah, it is so adorable. No, and I'm, so I've cute, never okay. seen the evolution form of this, by the way. I've never seen it before. My oh, first time witnessing this Pokemon. Let's see what we got. Ooh. Whoa. 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 Okay. Like it's that's a Ooh, dinosaur. She, she kind of fancy like the, uh, looking. Brachiosaurus, but it's like a water <laughs> Pokemon. <laughs> I mean, no, it's an like ice and rock type with yeah, refrigerated attack. So, so normal wow. type moves become ice type moves. And let's so get cute. Ammonite evolved. It's going to become, an, I think it's an Amistar. Yeah. This dude's pretty cool. You're about to Yo, see. Yo, he's watch. so cute with his googly he's eyes. He's cute. I don't no, see No, watch that. this. It's like a face hugger, bro. It's about to eat your face off. Look at this thing. Wait, wait. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, bro. He looks kind of <laughs> evil. And that concludes all the fossil Pokemon, the fossil Pokemon, that we have to level up. From days 1321 to 1336, as I was shopping to the beach bomb, I found two new Pokemon. I caught a Wimpod and right after a Shelter. <laughs> my goal was to get a Cloyster on my Pokemon. Pokemon team. Shiny Corsola! No way! Yo, that thing is so pretty, and it's level 50. And right after, I found a Luxio. I then traveled to a birch forest biome looking for a pink Beedrill. And the goal was to capture all eight pink special Pokemon. Everybody listen up. Whoa, Jamie just chopped down a whole tree. <laughs> yes, sir. So, getting Jamie. a pink Pokemon is extremely rare. Well, it's not that rare, but it's still kind of rare. So, what we okay. have to do is create... Oh! Ow. Wow, I'm on half a heart. That was pretty lucky. So, I'm going to make a ladder going all the way up in the sky. All right? Now, if a pink Beedrill spawns, it's going to be flying. So, we got to make sure we spawn yes. it. And it only spawns during afternoon time. So we only have a very small gap until it's the next day. So keep okay. your eyes open for any pink Pokemon. If we found our shiny Rotom, I'm pretty sure we can find a pink Beedrill. And there's still seven more we gotta find. Oh, that's a pretty good sign. I found a Beedrill, but it's a boss Beedrill. So there could be a shiny somewhere here or possibly yeah. a pink version of it. Now in the morning time, uh, Butterfree spawns. So in the morning, we get a, uh, a pink Butterfree. And during afternoon time, you can find yourself a uh, pink Beedrill. Dude, this place is huge. So what if we chop down all the trees? I feel like that could like kind of help out. Help? I, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. There's a lot. I don't know. It, it would just make it easier to spot them. That's the only thing I'm worried about. Look at all these trees falling down, bro. Ooh, Zacian. Ooh, where at? I found a Swirlix. I have a Swirlix. Never mind. Let me know if y'all see the Zacian. Zacian, Zacian. Ooh, a Milseries. Let me get one of these. I still need like 65 Milseries or 62 mm -hmm. or whatever you want to call it. There's a lot of them, bro. Oh, there it is. I it's just a it. regular one. What if like, I'm going to get knocked out by a tree? <laughs> 
Oh, I found a regular bee drill. Okay, okay, so this bee drill spawned on land. Now, the last time I found a pink bee drill in my single player world, it was. I think it was flying, I'm pretty sure. Like, it was flying over me, which is kind of sus. Hey, right, get out of here, bro. You're sabotaging me. Yeah, there it is. Look, it's another flying bee drill. So, it's kind of rough, dude. It's just gonna fly past us. Or it could be on the floor like that one. Yo, let's go. It's stuck in a tree. Hit it's man. literally stuck in a tree, too. No, no, no. It's, 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 it's trying to run away. It's trying to run away. Do it, do it. I'm coming. Oh, bro. what the heck, man? Like, my ultra balls don't work for some reason. <laughs> the crazy part is, I honestly don't understand how anybody could run Pixelmon, like, in single player. Unless you got, like, a crazy PC. Because this server that we're currently playing on, it is expensive. It is a very, 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 very expensive server, and it can still barely handle it. We had to upgrade it like a couple days ago. Dude, there's so many of them. I feel like half the Pokemon that I see now, I haven't even caught them before. There we go, my pink bee drill. Now let's put this bee drill in one of the boxes. This is Rainbow, Bolt, Summer, Ashen. Let's put it right here. So we'll do Strike Pokemon, and then we'll do also Pink Strike, and much better. Now the bee drill is a regular bee drill, Poison Bug type. Here's the attacks, and it's a ginormous size. That's a pretty a giant oversized. I'm surprised. Well, uh, we definitely uh, put in some work here. All right, now the trees yeah. are gonna regrow, so don't worry. And uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot. It's a lot. All for two Pokemon. The, the worst part is the other Pokemon spawn in different biomes, which is ridiculous. At least we get the flying oh, Pokemon out of the. What, what are you doing up there? What are you doing up there, bro? You see him? Yeah, I see him. He's like, I'm the king. Him. He's like, oh, I'm the king of the world. Yeah, most of the Pokemon here are actually pink, which is the funny part. Verizian! Verizian has spawned in a borch for it. Oh! No, 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 get it. Yeah, get what? it, get it. Is this it? Yeah, yeah, I know you saw you it. Hold on, I was looking for the Bruzian. Is this a big dude? Is this, is this him? Check if it's him. Yeah, it's him, it's him, it's wait, him. Wait, wait, I just got another big Pokemon. Oh, he's no, flying away, come on, he's dipping, bro. Well, yeah. I wanted to see he, if the legendary was a shiny. Dude, he's dipping, bro, he's out. Homie's gonna miss it. Literally. Nothing's stopping him. Yeah, no, I missed him. I missed it, I missed it, I missed it. No, 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 no. Oh, no, what do I do? Okay, hold on, I have an idea. Here's more Metal Gross, go, fly. Yeah, right there, Jamie, yep. That's the one. Go get him, my wings are not working. All right, come on, glide. Yeah! Oh, Dang no! it. I missed him. Bro, come on. Why is this so difficult? I'm trying. I wish I could throw an actual ball while I'm on a Pokemon. I wish it worked that way. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Jamie, she stole it from me. Yo, Jamie's dipping, bro. She's like, I'm out. I got you. Got you. Are you kidding me? Yo. Okay, fine. All right. Jamie we can gets trade it. We can one. trade it. Yo, we can trade it. Don't we'll worry. I really it later. want this one, though. I'm not going to lie. Yo, we literally that. just got rid of a whole entire forest for two. <laughs> yeah. For Jamie to catch it. Like, for what? Jamie to swoop in. For the next two pink Pokemon, we travel to the roof forest biome. This is, is this really like a roof forest? Are you kidding me? It's like a new advanced yeah, one, is. right? It's very cool. It's huge. Oh, look, a new Pokemon, a Volbeat. I don't have this guy yet. Let's make sure my Pokemon are going in the right box. So I'm in the rainforest biome, and you guys are in the roof forest. Now I'm we're looking for a Miss Drevis and a Miss Magius. Realistically, okay. we only need one of them, because you can actually evolve the one into the other. And I believe it spawns during nighttime. So both of them are at nighttime. Well, I'll get chopping. This one's a little yeah, bit more I'm difficult than chopping. usual. There he goes. Yo, that's a big tree. Necrozma has spawned in the roof oh, forest yo, biome. Oh, right near me. <laughs> is it right near you? Yeah, like literally right see. here. Is it a shiny? It's, no. Where is he? Oh, Not a man. shiny. Man, I really want a shiny Lunala. You don't right? want and, it. And, and a shiny. I want every single shiny Pokemon. <laughs> every shiny legendary. I'm catching a giant water spider. It's called a, a rock water rock, spider. Rock, 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 rock. Beastie problems. First try. Oh, now I'm just, yep, just swimming through a different, <gasps> different world. I think I got it. I think I yeah, got I it. I would love to see it. it. Just, you know, I can't see it anything. Is. Cloud. I see a pink cloud. Oh, I see the Necrozma. Oh, I see. Oh, I, was, okay. oh, I see it. Yo, that thing is gorgeous. It's like a hand cloud, right? You see the fingers. Yeah, I just caught one recently, but I'm surprised to find a pink one, too. That's pretty cool. I was looking for this Pokemon for the longest, too. Because I'm pretty sure you can only get them during, like, wait, no, I mean, it's different now with the biomes and stuff, but I'm pretty sure, like, back in the Pixabon days, when they added Mischievous in, you can only get it during Halloween time. Really? That's or maybe that was a spectral jeweler, which is, like, completely out of the game now. Woo! First run! Oh! And there we have the pink Mistrevis. See him exactly as a regular one. Here's the stats. Exact same thing, but it's a ginormous size. And if it takes us too long, we'll probably just take Mistrevis and evolve it into Miss Maggie's. Oh, I found the pink Miss Maggie's. Let's go. Oh my God. Yo, y'all really missed this thing, bro. It was right in front of you. No, don't you dare. Here's our Miss Maggie's. And here is our Mistrevis. Not a bad combination. Pretty cool Pokemon. Here is the stats for this one. And here's the next one. Nice. And this one is also a ginormous. What a really bad nature. It's adamant nature. Complete opposite of what we need. Now let's move these Pokemon into the pink box. And then we spend the rest of the night traveling to the Savannah biome. And once it was daytime, we were searching for a pink Nidoking and a pink Nidoqueen. 
And now we wait for a pink needle king and a needle queen to spawn. Jamie, are you trying to catch me? What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Jamie. Bro? Jamie's like, let me just catch this Pokemon right here. Got me a rare candy. I feel like we've already caught almost... Oh, I haven't caught this one. Never mind. I was about to say, we've caught nearly every single Pokemon in the Savannah biome. I just can't think of what else we're missing. Probably a King Gascon. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I'll have to see for sure. Never mind. I've got a shiny and a regular one of King Gascon. King Gascon. Never mind. I have a shiny and a regular King Gascon. Never mind. Okay, I was completely wrong on that one. Oh, there it is. That's it. That's the one right there. Yeah. Yo, that's it. Yo, for a no second, way. I oh, thought it was it. like the... um. What, what is it? Like the, like the purple boss. And... My yeah, Pokemon I know what you're dead. saying. Great. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna use Snorlax. Oh man. Okay, this is gonna be a little bit risky. Bite. Don't kill it. Don't you kill it. Oh, okay. Okay. Alright, we're good. We're wow. good. We're fine. Nothing happened. Toy did almost kill this thing. No big deal. We're fine. No. <laughs> we're completely fine. Yo! Let's go! Now we talking, baby. Now we talking. One down, one more to go. So while y'all stay here, I'm gonna fly to the next Savannah biome so we can have two coverages at once. It's better to stay in one biome, but I wanna check out this corner over here. It's like, it's like the Savannah Plateau biome or something. I'm looking for some shinies, and I'm also looking for a Bolton. And as I was saying, like I said, we already have the Kangaskin, the Kangaskin, I can't speak English. <laughs> Ooh, look at the Pokemon collection. Not bad. Do I have the Zebra? Oh, I don't have him yet. No way. It's like the most simple Pokemon I've actually missed somehow. Oh, a big DD has spawned! Sir, 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 sir. You just you just gotta you just gotta get an ultra. Sir, sir. It's like ultra balls just don't work no more. <laughs> Ooh, look at this dude. No way. Hey, has anybody seen the Victini yet? Um, no, nope, but it might not be near yet. me, I think. It. It's gotta be somewhere around here. I'm looking for one right now. It doesn't seem to be near me. It could be over there. It's like a... You already have one. What do you mean, Jamie? I forget. You probably have one in your inventory. Is I really small? can't describe it to you. It's like a small mouse. And it turns out it's not a shiny. Nope, just a regular Victini. Are that you kidding sucks. me? Are you kidding me? No way. No flipping way. Yo, yo, I literally turned around and my guy is right here. Ew. My guy just spawned right, right here. Look, the Needle Queen. So I already have, I think I have a Nido King, right? Or is it a Nido oh. King? I can't tell. So I currently have the Nido King, and this is the Nido Queen. Wow. Let's yeah, go. Really? Now I just gotta try my best <laughs> not to one-shot it. Dude, that was literally insane. I turned around, and he's just chilling there, bro. No, this is a different one, Jamie. This is a completely That's different one. Dinosaur. Oh. So one is a Nido King, oh. and one is a Nido Queen. <laughs> so the Nido Queen spawns during <laughs> afternoon <laughs> time, Honestly. and Nido King spawns during, I think it was daytime. Yeah, Yo, that's cool, bro. Try, baby. Let's go. Cool. Yeah. Okay, no so that's a fireworks, though. What a party. Dude, that was actually crazy. Now I can't okay. tell if this one is like an actual okay. Needle King anymore. Hold on. I think I'm mixing them up. Let's see real quick. Is it Maybe a real I did get them mixed up. Okay. So this is a... I don't know. Wait, I think that's regular. What do you mean you don't know? No, like I'm being serious. Look, it looks the same, right? Oh. No, it's a different color. So I think, no, I think no, my Needle King... Queen and King. Yeah. Yeah, but the Needle Queen is good. That's that's true. But I think the Needle King is wrong. I really can't tell. Here, let me let me pull out my Needle King that I currently have. Oh, I forgot where I put my Pokemon. And here Here's the stats for Nido King. There we go. And then Nido Queen. Perfect. So we're just missing two more Pokemon. And finally, we travel to the Swamp Biome looking for a pink Venonat <laughs> and a pink Venomoth. Dude, the Swamp Biome looks pretty cool, right? Oh, a Poliwhirl. Cool. I already have a Poliwhirl, apparently. Yeah, I like I like this entire place. It's a it's called the Wetlands. It's not even like a Swamp Biome anymore. But Venonat and Venomoth should still spawn here. Now, they both spawn during afternoon time. Do we have a grammar on the team? Oh, I don't. You see the most basic Pokemon you wouldn't expect me not to have and there you go I don't even have it. I think I also still needed a muck as well. Yeah, we're still missing that Pokemon We're also missing a poly swirl I think and a shelter. Never mind. I meant to say cloister. Look at that beaver. That is a quality beaver Wow, straight from the swamp biome. Yes, its name beaver. is Bibaron. Wow, what a wild Pokemon Let me put him on the Pokemon team. Yo, at this point 71% complete for the Pokedex. Yo, we're, we're getting pretty close I gotta say. Yo, that's actually insane. That's what I was saying Bro, Dude, and there's still so to many that. Pokemon that we're finding that we can still catch. Like this guy right here, I, know. I don't even have a Yanma, I don't even have it's this guy. We only have a few more Pokemon to go, or well, a few more hundred Pokemon to go, <laughs> and then we're gonna be done with the Pokedex. Okay, so everyone keep your eyes open for a Venonat, Venonat, okay, I'm looking. or okay. a Venomoth. Okay, I just found two of them right over here, but they're not pink. I was gonna say, what does it look like? But obviously, it's literally a moth. Oh, my wings broke. No, and all of this, no, okay, so everything from here is a swamp biome. I found a house. Why is there a house here? Literally Aww. one lonely house. It looks a little sus. Kinda... I'm breaking in. What's going on here, sir? Just because I am partial to traditional painting methods doesn't mean that I don't like Porygon. What? Thank you that, for your advice. That, Does that this advice. dress makes my hips look big? Um, I'm not gonna answer yeah. that, and I'll be on my way. Very... 
Yeah, I don't know, bro. We weird, uh, weird house of people. <laughs> From days 1337 to 1347, I showed off my pink Pokemon collection. Let's flex all the pink Pokemon. We have a pink Beedrill. Then we got ourselves a pink Nidoking. A pink Nidoqueen. All right, now we're sitting at a, at a, at a Venomoth. Yes, a pink Venomoth. This one's pretty cool looking. I like the eyeballs and everything. I think it's a really great details right here. Now, don't forget, we also have a Venonat. There we go. Pretty cool. And then we got a Butterfree. Gorgeous, right? Gorgeous Butterfree. That's a oh, lot yeah. of pink Pokemon. What do you guys think? It's just pink. And here is my Miss Magius. And here is my Miss Dreamus. Oh, that's, and that's one one. we're forgetting one. What are we forgetting, Jamie? We're forgetting oh, the, the Mew. How the can Mew. we forget about oh, the Mew? Oh, yeah, the Mew. Just the Mew. Yeah, <laughs> the Mew. And right after, I found a brand new location to put gyms inside the Pokemon City. All right, so let's make ourselves structure blocks. And now, luckily, our modder has been able to code this in for us because we have a really cool idea. Now, for our server, we exclusively can craft structure blocks. Now, with these structure blocks, we can actually place them in survival mode. As you can see, this is a rock gym. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's a rock gym. <laughs> now we gotta first select coordinate number one. So let's line it up right here. So we're gonna put this down right here. Boom. All right. And we're gonna set this to corner one. Perfect. And let's call it rock gym one. And if you're really into Pixamon, you do know that Pixamon has its own structure command where you can actually like spawn in structures. But we're not doing that. So we're doing this the legit way, of course, because this is a hundred things. So let's grab all these. And now we're gonna build up. Yeah, what the Blastoise doing? bro <laughs> just chilling up there okay and then here is coordinate number two to so grab another structure block place it right there and let's select coordinate number two so corner number two and call it rock gym one there we go now i'm gonna go to the first one so from the corner i'm gonna go over to save i'm gonna hit detect and now it should be able to detect the entire rock gym there we go it might get slightly cut off but i think it'll be fine that's it also click include entities and then click save and there we go. A rock gym is ready to go. Yo, look at this beautiful biome. Wow, this looks amazing. Now, clear the entire area out. You don't actually have to, but if you want to, you can. Then type in load rock gym one. Include entities. Load that in and just hit load one more time. And there you go. You got yourself a full out rock gym in here. And we do have to make some very small changes like the flooring here, for example. We can change it to sand, stone, or whatever we want it to be, pretty much be. Now, I need your recommendation. Should we take every single gym and put them in the same biome? I'm like in a repeated process. So for example, let's say like you got one gym and then the next gym over here and they're just gonna loop around the entire city. And the reason I'm doing this, I wanna eventually take this entire map, have every single gym in here inside of our own city and then publish it as a map for the fans. So it's gonna be pretty cool. Okay, so check this out. This is the entire Pokemon city we've built over 1400 days of Pokemon. Now there's plenty of space to put new gyms and we've calculated it. There is, there is 14 gyms. That's the first one and the other other ones do get gradually bigger so we can either spread them out all around this entire city or just kind of put them in different like locations by well now by looking from over here i think it's a good idea to kind of like make a gym over there over there over there over there because there's a lot of empty spots that we haven't filled in so i don't know I, I feel like it's kind of up to the fans just comment down below and uh i'll check it out yeah we can even put one over here over on this side like that way there can be already like three gyms uh we can have like four and five maybe one on top of the mountain as like the sixth gym then we need the seventh one over in this corner. We're gonna have the eighth one here, but I still want to expand out the city, add in way more buildings, and I have a lot of cool ideas. It's gotta be the best Pokemon city in my life. Yo, Connor's going to work, bro. Look at Connor. I'm going crazy. It's pretty cool. Here, Connor, while you work on this, let me see what kind of blocks we can actually mess with. Ooh, we could put like fossils around that gym. That'd be kind of yeah, cool. Definitely got to build a Pokemon statue. We can even add in some ruins. That's a good idea. Yo, that'd be sick. Yo, a nose pass is spawned. Hold on, where are you going, bro? No, a, a promo pass. I haven't got this guy yet. Let's go. And there we go. Dude, we definitely need a statue here. I don't know, like a really, really cool statue. Maybe like a Geodude or something. Or we can have like a fossil Pokemon statue. I'm not really sure what I'm building here. I'm going to attempt to make a tiny Geodude. All right, so far, so good. I'm a little bit worried about the face. We don't really have that much space to make it work. And he kind of needs like a unibrow. <laughs> we got to give him a unibrow, dude. Okay. For sure. Yeah, it definitely needs a unibrow, dude. Oh, there we go. You had it, Connor. My bad. Okay, so what about the mouth? How are we going to add in the mouth? <laughs> yeah, yeah, literally like that. You ready? You ready? You ready? Um, wait, I got this. I got this. Ready? And Does then... that look good? Wait, wait, wait. No, no. Put that one back. Put that one back. This one here? So, like, like this? No, no, no. Like mine it out. Mine it out. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, right, ready? Right, ready? Right. Ready? Yeah, ready? Okay, so, so place this. Okay. Down or like the pink, there you go. Right. Like okay. that. Wait, 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 watch this. Okay, on the top. Yep, yep, yep. 
<laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. It was no looking way. good, and then Connor said, "Let me just give him that." <laughs> wait, wait, wait. There's one big, one big tooth. But they don't have teeth, bro. They've been oh, they boxing. Don't? They don't have teeth. Oh, okay, that's awkward. Yep. Dude, this literally reminds me of my hundred days dog session that I did. <laughs> All right, I guess we can like fill in this blocks underneath. I don't, I don't know, man. Let's make it look good, bro. This is why you're the professional builder, Connor. Yep, I'm here for that. I know. Oh, this looks good. Look at this, right? That does look good. Yeah, he just looks like. This is a grandpa. I don't know, like that. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was gonna say. There we go. Say. Yeah. <laughs> no, I have an idea. Ready? <laughs> 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 yes! He's eating boulders. He's eating boulders. Okay. That's it. That's it. Yum, 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 yum. So, Jamie, oh, where's your uh, cobblestone tree? Uh, okay, so come here. Wow. Usually I just Jamie. The railroad. This is, okay, um, Jamie. This like is it? quality. I like your quality. Tree. Quality. <laughs> Wait, guys, are you memeing? Are you oh, we're not memeing. Here, let me just let me just box the tree, Coming. Connor. Yo, you want to join in on this boxing match? Yo, I would no, love guys, goblin stop. and not right I now. I actually love it. <laughs> See, this is I think really, really, watch it, watch it, watch it. Ready? 360? I think it looks really good, Jamie. Yeah. Do you like it? Boom, 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 boom. Whatever, you guys suck. I'm going to take my, my mine cart and get out of here. From day 1348 till 1354, I traveled to the forest bottom and caught four milceries. The goal was to evolve them into four different forms of alchemy. So as long as they're in my inventory, they're going to give us all the loot. Now, since it is nighttime and I have one milcery, I'm going to actually right-click it. And we're going to do a 360 like this. <laughs> <laughs> right, everybody, everybody dance, everybody dance. There we go. This is also in the birch forest biome. It is going to evolve into a milcery star sweet night form one. Okay. It's kind of confusing, but I did show you guys the chart wow. on the screen of all the milcery evolution forms. I think this is the wrong one, is it? Do you mess it up? You messed it up. This is the forest biome by accident. Oh. Yep. We were supposed to be what? right over here in the birch, oh. right there. Oh. Ah. Yeah. But hey, at least it's one of the forms. So yeah, with that picture that I put up on the screen, it's going to tell you exactly where the mill series evolve, what, what condition has to be, what biome, and all that kind of stuff. And we're going to just kind of crisscross the, just pretty much match him. <laughs> and since it's currently sunrise, that's going to be a strawberry sweet. And if we go to the birch forest, we can probably get one right now. Here is the second mill series. So yes, dance, we are dance. in the birch forest. Right click, 360. 360. All right, everybody dance. Here we My go. My mouse yeah. kind of died. <laughs> Baby, and now wait for it to evolve. Three. So it should be a light, uh -huh. like, a, like, a, like a red and, I don't know, it's supposed to look like a strawberry cake. Oh, it works. Yes, it works. Strawberry. Oh, we got so it. Cute. And got whipped it. cream. Let's go. There we go. Yes, yeah, so that is, that's exactly what we needed. It matches. Perfect. Okay, so we did, that. we did it right this time. And I'm pretty sure it's 72 or 73 total forms. That's crazy. Yo, check out this yacht. Look at this place, bro. This is cool. So we're in the mushroom bottom next. There's some Dynamax stuff. Now, Jamie, Connor, yo, yeah. I think yep. we should live here. Like, this is like a nice little setup over here. Look at that. My boys be balling out with a yacht. <laughs> So, this is the Mushroom Island biome. What's the Mushroom Island shore? And while it is afternoon time, let's take out our milcery in the Mushroom Island. Right click it. 360 it. Hey guys, I think I need a 360 for me too. Oh. Oh. Everyone has to do a 360 in front of it. I'm here, ready? Dance. Dance. It's not working. Okay. I think we missed the time. Yeah, we missed it. Dang it. You have to be pretty quick with it. So, let's try the store suite and dance. Everybody dance. Dance. 360. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. No? Come on, bro. Oh, it's. Oh. Yes. We did it. We did it. Perfect. Yes. And then we go. Right. It's evolving. Can't see behind this mushroom. What, what's going on? This Balling. mushroom is blocking my view. Ooh, Balling. it worked. So let's see which one this is. The yeah, mushroom dripping, island. The dripping water. All right, I'm trying to figure out which form of milcery this is. Yellow on the thing. Okay, yeah, there we go. This is the milcery mushroom island nighttime form. That's a lot to say. <laughs> this is my army of cakes. Yes, yes. I will have the best birthday ever. Yes, cake army. Let's go. Follow me. Among Us. Look, it's literally Among Us. <laughs> now for the matcha cream milcery. Boom. Matcha. Rotate, 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 rotate. Spin, spin, dance. No, it's not working. Everybody dance in front of the milcery. Dance? I'm trying to dance. I'm on my way. I'm going to plug in my mouse. Spin. It's not working. It's supposed to be afternoon time. Come on. Is it afternoon? Spin. I think I pushed it. I don't know. Watch me dance, milcery. <laughs> this looks ridiculous, bro. We're literally dancing for ice creams. Great. Is it not afternoon time yet? So it's supposed to be the matcha cream. It's in the jungle biome. And at nighttime, no, at afternoon time, you give it a very sweet, and it should evolve 
into a matcha cream. What is wrong with this guy? All right, everybody, dance. You gotta go. Dance. And finally, after waiting another day, there you go. It's like you gotta be precise, and if you miss it, it's game over. <laughs> I think it works. So this is the Milsuri uh, afternoon matcha cream. What is going on? <laughs> Wait, I think we made a mistake. Yeah, that's it. Never mind. This is it. This is it. Okay, never mind. I was wrong. <laughs> it's good. Jamie, Jamie, Jamie. There's a Tapu. Tapu. Later, they just spawn right next to you. And I just saw a special Pokemon here. It was like a. Where'd he go? No, I just saw him. There it is. There it is. No, there it is. Right here. Look, He's right there it is. Look at the shoulder. I noticed the shoulder right next to Jamie, and I was like, that's not a normal shoulder. That has what? to be a Valencian shoulder. I'm, I'm calling it right now. Oh, you want the Tapu Lele? Okay, you get that one. I just wanted the shoulder. That that was it. I'm not. A, I'm you know. I'm just. I'm a simple man. Yes, this is it. So excited. Okay. The only thing is, I don't know if you can have a Valencian cloister. I'll look into it later. But I wanted to have like a special cloister, and I think this is gonna do it. And the final military form. Dance. Go. Dance. Stand in front of it. Go. Rotate. Dance. No, it's not working. Come on. No. Come on. Evolve. I'm not sure if we're in the right biome. <laughs> so we're supposed to be in the uh, what is it called? The redwood biome or the no the me the mega taiga. But the issue is with all these biomes that we've added in, it's now called like weird biome names. I, so I'm not sure if this is right. This is the Redwood Tiger Hills M. Never heard of that before, and the trees are different, so we really can't tell if this is the right yeah. spot. Jamie, this is a grotto. You know what this is? So this is just no. like a master ball at the bottom, and then that's like how you get like special loot. Yeah, you know? I just opened it. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. <laughs> Attempt number. Nope, didn't work. Let's try. Star Sweet. Oh! Oh, it's working, actually. Oh, we got it. We got it. Let's go. Okay, now it should become. I don't know which one it's gonna become, honestly. I have no idea anymore. I think it's gonna be the Caramel Swirl Nighttime form because we used a, uh, I think the star one. Yep, that's definitely it. That is, is it? Yeah, that's the nighttime one. Got it. So that is the nighttime, uh, Milsuri. Uh, no, Alchemy. My head hurts. <laughs> On days 1355 to 1365, I caught a new Pokemon. And then I gave Jamie a pine cone. Are you eating that? Oh, oh, what's wrong with you? Mm. Are you eating a pine cone? Mm, pine cone tastes good. <laughs> And then I spent the rest of the days catching new Pokemon. My goal was to complete the Pokedex. So we're gonna stack up on Milseries. There's, there's a bunch of them spawning here. And I'm also trying to catch every Pokemon in the Mega Tiger Bomb, so I don't have to come back here. It's kind of like a little bit tricky with the Pokedex. It like works sometimes and doesn't work the other times. What is this thing? The Pharaoh. Ooh, ooh, I don't have this guy. Come here. Come here, my friend. There we go. Another one. Let's go. Yeah. Yes. This is insane. Like, if you look at the Pokedex, there's just so many Pokemon. Really it's crazy. Is. And I can see like the ones that I'm missing, which are like mainly the evolution forms. And we're definitely missing also the Ultra Beast Pokemon. But Gen 8 is nearly complete. Timber! Let's go, my guy. I don't have this dude for sure. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, Timber, where you going, my friend? Yo, we can't pass up on a Mega Heracross. Let's put this thing on fire. I'm sorry. It's the only way. Oh, it's gotta hurt. Yo, we almost one-shot me. Let's go. I'll take that. Yo, this biome definitely has a lot of Pokemon we haven't captured. Jamie, if you see anything that looks sus, you let me know. And we'll let you know, absolutely. It's, it's gotta too, be I'm a Pokemon right that is so cool that no one has ever seen before. You ever see that? I do. Oh, found a girl, though, with a weakness policy. Check this out. I've never catched. I never catch it. I never caught a young goose. Why have I never caught a young goose? I don't know. Probably because a of that. A young goose? Oh, yeah. Me too. Yeah, yeah, it's like a young goose. moose, but it's like actually a goose, but it's actually huh. young. So it's a goose. Got you. Young goose. Okay. What? Have I caught a sea king? I feel like I've definitely caught a sea king. I don't know. I'm like, no, I haven't. You see, I feel like I've caught it, but I'm, I know I'm mixing it up with like my other 15 Pixelmon series I've done. Or maybe 20. I have, I have no idea. There's been so many Pixelmon series. Come back. No, don't leave me. Don't leave me. This is a cherry Blossom Grove biome. So let's see what we so find pretty. in here. Now, Jamie, take some of these trees and let's go ahead and use this for our um, village. Yeah, kind of cool. You definitely got to like spread out the entire too. village with like those um, the palm trees and the cherry blossom trees and every yeah, other cool tree we find. Yeah, you saw the deer. I, I just saw like, one of them running through. Yeah, I have them, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I already have all the sauce bugs. So we're just missing like the most basic evolution Pokemon. What is that? Is that a fire ship? Oh, that is a ship. Wow. Yeah, this biome doesn't have much Pokemon spawning other than like deer. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's only deers and like the Suwaddle Pokemon. I found a Hitmontop. I'm not sure why there's a Charmander here. I'm a little bit confused about that. I don't know why. Why is my boy over here like survival of the fittest trying to survive in this terrible bio? <laughs> Get over here, Hitmontop. Get in here. Let's go. No box in the ball. <laughs> I can definitely tell that uh, it's getting a little more difficult to find Pokemon. Yeah. Yeah, it really is. When you want to like, look for we Pokemon, we gotta definitely start evolving them, bro. Hi, uh, guys. Totally. <laughs> All right, guys, I think my time is, uh, my time is up. I'll see you in another jump, life. Jump, 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 jump. Hey, we're 
we're both flying! Oh, wait. <laughs> Jamie wait, can't even fly, bro. <laughs> Jamie <laughs> doesn't know how to use Elijah Wakes. <laughs> I think I found something here. Oh! And Meloetta has fallen on the flower floor. Oh! Oh! What the heck? It just teleported on me. Yo, that was... That was what, sus. What? An Enderman Pokemon? No, that is a... Uh, that, that was a zombie villager. I found some kind of an abandoned oh, house here. Oh, really? Yeah. No way, Jose. Wait, where's the spawner at? I don't see it. So, did you see the Meloetta? The Melo with the Melo... <laughs> I'm in the extreme hills biome, so it's definitely I'm not in here. I'm in more. You're, what? What does that mean? With oh, you're in the biome that I passed by. That one, right? Yeah, there's a lot of cool stuff guy? in here, like a uh, cluster geese. Oh, I don't have this dude. You see? A rock roof and a squirt rupee. No, that Pokemon broke out. Dang it. Gotta go back for it. Come on. Go with the Pokeball. Stop making my life miserable. <laughs> Do I have a spindle? Mm -hmm. Spindle. Is it? A lichen rock. Let's go. I don't have this rock. Lichen rock. Oh. rock. Uh huh. Huh? It's rock like. Light. What? Lichen rock. Like, like. Hit that like button. No, I got it. I got it. Hit it's the a like rock? button. Yeah. Yeah, yeah go wait. hit the like button with the rock. Wait, wait, wait. Guys. Oh, wait. The don't do it. flower bottom right here. Find the. Oh! Bro! I Who told you! Jamie's like, nah, George, why are you wasting your time? Read the Meloetta if you already have one. Jamie, Jamie, because it could be a shiny, <laughs> a shiny Meloetta. Sorry, I had to just kind of I mean, express myself Yeah, there. like, you're, you're right, okay. <laughs> you see? Let's see what I'm talking about. This is exactly why you always double check. You never know. Oh, absolutely. <sighs> always double check. Okay, now I'm never going to use that Pokemon ever again because I don't like it. <laughs> Nice. Whatever. I'm gonna get a shining dealing. Wait, where'd you find a shining dealing from? What are you, you talking find about? A shiny right? dealing? Where? Yeah. Where? Oh, I captured it with my Wait, master. Wait, you really? Yeah. Master really? ball the shiny dealing. Yeah, I wanted it. <sighs> I don't know. I don't have any Ultra Balls right now, okay? Please. I know. I know. Use it's bad of me. The most expensive yes. thing ever. Master I'm too balls lazy. I'm sorry. Master Balls shiny Pokemon, Jimmy. Well, it shiny is Pokemon. shiny. It was a shiny dearling. Shiny yeah, legendary right. Pokemon. I still can't believe she Master Balls shiny <laughs> Pokemon. This <laughs> is the shiny Meloetta with a different form. And here is the regular Meloetta with another form. Check it out. So shiny and then non-shiny. So it goes from orange to, uh, I guess, like a more of a violet color, I guess. Yeah. 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 From day 1366 to 1376, I placed out new saplings all around the Pokemon City. And right after I went fishing for some rare Pokemon. Man, where are all these fish out, bro? I can't seem I to know. find a normal I fish. Know, I don't similar. understand, bro. We got a 37% completion rate on my Magikarp, but still no fish. No <laughs> fish. That ain't good, man. <laughs> so... We're trying to complete the Magikarp log. Um, uh, it's 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 a lot. It's a lot. You know, we have three shallows, and that's only 12%. You know what I mean? These are all the fish that I have, which are Magikarps, and that's only 37%. Now, in terms of the the, the Clobopus, uh, that one we don't even have at all. You know, I literally have like only two of them apparently. I don't even know where they're at. <laughs> oh, there they are, right here. I didn't even know they counted towards the fishing log. So yeah, definitely a long way to go. Well, Jamie, this is your first time fishing with us. You know how this works, right? I fished with you guys before. Oh, oh yeah. Really? Yeah. Uh, we don't we don't yeah. remember yeah. at all for some reason. <laughs> fisherman here. Ah, and you got a, is this like a special Pokemon? I can't tell. This might be a special Remoroid. I can't tell at all. It looks like a shiny for some reason. So, Jamie, you gotta catch one of the following Pokemon, okay? There's like the Octopus one, all right? It's cool. Let's call it like Clobopus. And then there is also uh, a Magikarp. And there's yeah. Shellos, all right? Those are the main guys. Oh, Stop dogs. Sure. And then there's also another one, which is called a Sfeel. Now, Sfeel fishing, we gotta go to a whole new biome for that, I'm pretty sure. Remoroid. You got a Remoroid? No, it's not yeah. good enough. My fish keep getting away. Just wait until it has an exclamation mark and then right click it. Oh, um, no. I got a That's a big one. Ah, core fish, don't eat it. Do do? We only need Magikarps, Shallows, Spheels, oh, and it's just a wishy-washy. I would highly recommend having your strong, shiny lore on yeah. just in case we get a shiny. This entire place is about to be filled with shiny Magikarps. Oh, yeah. I, I can just, I can just like, guarantee it. <laughs> oh, you see? Look, 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 look. Right there. There you go. Guys, you see it? There it is. No, I don't know. Nope, no, that's not it. Hold on. I don't see nothing. Yo, there's a shiny in here. Help me find it. Oh, there it is right there. Eh. Yes! Come on, come on. That's a shiny wishy-washy. Yeah! Yeah, let's go. I love those sound effects in the background while you're fishing. You're just like, yeah. Elmo, you know, mola, mola, mola. So we found another old fisherman and we brought some more fishing rods. Now, that fisherman looks Ooh, fit for a mola? professional. Nice. Okay, so this one is assessed as the pro's super rod. Now, this good rod is assessed for a standard good rod. Then we have the old rod, which is assessed as the good old rod. So we're That's doing okay some more commission. research and trying to learn this. Now, when it comes to shell it's way more difficult. So there's like uh, over nine different assessments for your fishing rod, which gives you different chances of the specific shells that you have to get, which are also different rarities. So yeah, it gets kind of complex. Now we cannot find Magikarps with a super rod. So you got to use an old rod or a good rod. And a good rod gives you a 25% chance to find, I guess, I, I don't know, like a, like an East Shellos, if that makes any sense. So yes, use old rods for uh, old no rods, Magikarps. Old rods, good rods, bad rods. I don't know, man. It's all yep. the same thing. 
to be able to show fish. Rides, bro. I, like, why are you doing way it to these rods? Why they gotta make it so complex, man? We should be fishermen. Yep, they gotta make this game a lot more simple. Oh, there's a monument. Yeah, I'm gonna go there, guys. Yeah, I'm with you. Man, back in my day, it was so much more simple. Now, oh, wait a minute. Yeah, magic carp. Is that shiny magic carp? Not a shiny magic carp. Not a shiny magic carp. Not a shiny magic carp. Not a shiny magic carp at all. I'm disappointed. I found me a special magic carp. It's got. No way. It's right, man. Right, right. <laughs> I think I'm, this is it. This so has to I be can a hear it in my one. brain, but my mouth don't hear it. <laughs> what do we got this time? <laughs> oh, this is gonna be so confusing though. Okay, I okay, can't tell. Do I have this one? I don't know. They, they look the same. Yeah, they look the same. Never mind. Dude, I can't catch anything. Yeah, it's it was like, kind I of annoying. Already. Guys, I'm getting frustrated. I found a I'm usually patty. really good at fishing. This ain't fair. Patty. I told you, Jamie, this is like fishing on another level. I know. Yeah, this I like is it's extreme fishing. But still. Honestly, this should be in the Olympics. Arboke? Yeah, Pokemon jump fishing. You got a barbel. Oh, I found me a special magic carp. This one's for the record books. Get your record book out. Call up old Betsy. We got to show yep. her what we got. I got my record book out. <laughs> I'm about to play Look at this. Track. This is a, a very specific fish. It's, uh, oh, I already have it. Never mind. <laughs> Dude, they all look the same to me. I can't tell. Like, it's slightly different. Yeah, they all look the same. Let's see. Is there, like, a difference? No. There's literally no difference. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> I found another magic carp, and I think I see a shiny in the water. It's, like, yellow. It's definitely a shiny. Yo, is, you see that yellow shiny? Yo, yeah. go, go after it. Call up Uncle okay, Lou. We got to go get it. <laughs> <laughs> Are you fishing? What about the shiny? Oh, I'm going for him. I'm going. Hold on a second. Is that that's that's gotta be a boss? It's not a shiny, is it? Nope. That's just the regular boss Pokemon. Great. Now let's see what a good rod is gonna get us. Maybe it's gonna give us a bigger chance for getting the other Pokemon that we want. Just a regular Magic Carp. Great. <laughs> ah, amazing. I got me a Shellos. It's a blue Shellos. Yeah. I don't know if it's that a special good? Shellos, but like I said, it's a blue one. Blue? I think it's a regular one. That's the regular blue. Shellos, bro. Oh man, my life. <laughs> yeah, it looks like a like a regular one. I mean, it's still completes the fishing log. Now I'm at 18%. And I have 40% of magic carps. Well, I managed to catch the same exact magic carps. Literally the same ones. I don't think I have one of these Pokemon. What is this? It's called a frill. Oh, I got a pink one. I think I don't have the pink one yet. Or maybe I do. <laughs> I don't know. We're about to find out. I only have 40% of the Pokedex complete. I mean, the fishing log. And now we're sitting at 45. So yes, that was a brand new fish. Magic carp. Yeah. Wow, the, you know what I'm going to do? What? I'll show you. I feel like that spot's unlucky. Gotta be on the is boat. That, is that it? You know what I mean? Are you a fishing you, expert? You, How many different magic carps you catch? Uh, you know, I, uh... You don't use the wrong know? one. You gotta use an old rod. That's assessed by this old fisherman next to me. That's the only way, JV. I have the old rod, too. I got another one. This has to be a different one. I can tell already. My boys, are yeah? you ready? You're scaring my fish away, Jamie. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Kyogre has spawned <laughs> in the deep ocean biome. Where is that thing? Is it? Oh, it's right there. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, an octillery. You get it? So, we've been getting advanced. Now, when it rains, it increases the chance of Magikarps and other Pokemon spawning. We've also managed to get the rods to supreme status. So just get a bunch of rods and you can just pretty much keep talking to them. And now we'll get them to a supreme status. So we're good on that, but we're still not getting the Magikarps we're looking for. <laughs> I'm uh. worried that the rain is kind of interfering with the spawn rates and then giving us less Magikarps and more rare Pokemon. I don't know. There's a lot of math that goes into... Sir, please, can you... What's going on here? <laughs> math and fishing. It makes sense. Oh, I see something. Something rare. I see it. I see it. That's a villain. Valencian. Has to be Valencian form. Snipe, snipe it. Yes, got the snipe. All right, I found a special Corsola. Let's Ooh. go. Got him. Oh no, Connor. Yeah. I'm not gonna make it. Let's all try and get a Supreme Rod. Where are you? <laughs> yep. Oh, oh my God. God. It's okay. We're good. Shiny. Go, 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 go. Yo, oh. got it? He's coming right for me. He already knows. He's like, yo, Moose, I need the shiny. <laughs> Jamie, just keep circling around. It's going to scare it. <laughs> yes. Let's go. Advancement made in your neighborhood. Yes. I found another magic card. This might be a rare one. I feel like I already have it. I don't know. Oh, wait. I don't have this one. Yo, we're at 48%. No way. Still a lot to go. There's over 32 magic so cards, by the way. Yes. 32 different magic cards. Another one. Yo. -ho -ho. I got, I got a blue go. magic card. A blue one. Yeah, yeah, get it, get it, get it. Okay, I captured it, guys. Yo, congratulations. I got a special magic card. Oh my gosh, okay, cool. Yeah, okay. One I got one that has stripes. One that has stripes. Okay, stripes? perfect, perfect. So now we're... Now we're almost getting yeah. there. Everyone's like, okay. getting a little lucky now. <laughs> Yo, I see the blue one. Did you just find the blue one? Uh, no, Another I'm getting something else right now. right now. There's literally a blue one in the water, bro. Did you, see, did you catch it? No, uh, I didn't. I'm getting this one right Jimmy, now. Jimmy, was that you? Yeah, I just got another blue one. 
Oh, okay. I was about to say, look what? Look at mine. Look at mine. Dude, that thing is sick. Yes. So cool. I'm so happy. We're going to complete the fishing log. <laughs> I feel you got to catch every single magic card possible. It's like the only way to know if it's like a special one or not a special one. They all look identical too. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they kind of do, honestly. Like some of them have like those identical forms that you can't even tell. They have like one small thing different. Purple magic card. Ooh, congrats, oh, no, my guy. Yo, I heard it. I heard it go off. Oh, I got, I got a purple right one here. too. You got a purple one too. I see it. Yeah. Yeah, get all of them. <laughs> there we go. There's mine. Dude, that Finally. looks sick. That's a good one too. Aww. I have no more space for the magic carps. And so we went back home and I traded all the special magic carps with my friends. Look at this combination. Magic carp the peckish. That, that's pretty Yo, cool, man. That's, run. Yeah. That's really cool. So yeah, my fishing yeah. log is still at 48.57% because I didn't capture these guys. So uh. that's the only issue. If I don't catch them, apparently it does not count towards it. So it's kind of like the only downside to it. Unless I already have most of these. No, never mind. I don't. On days 1377 to 1382, we traveled to the Ultra Dimension. We were searching for the Ultra Beast called Zerkitree. I found a Bond Sweet. That's a new Pokemon. Let's go. What? So we're looking for a Zerkitree or Zerkitree or I don't know how to pronounce it exactly, but I found an Esper, another Woo! rare Pokemon. Well, not a rare Pokemon. Oh, Zernia spawn. It's not exactly a rare Pokemon, but it's the Pokemon I haven't caught yet. I think it should be somewhere. Why wow, you move so slow in this biome. I know, right? I feel like a turtle, dude. So Zerkitree's old. There he is. Zerg trees are not that rare, uh, but they're pretty much Ultra Beast Pokemon, and you can find them in here. We still have like a few more to go. I can't exactly remember how many Ultra Beasts we're missing, but I know we have like a majority of them, especially when we were hatching Pokemon eggs. That was helping us a bunch. And just by looking at all these, we're missing one, two. Looks like we're only missing two Pokemon, supposedly. So two more Ultra Beasts, and this is the third one. Come on, buddy. I'm not wasting these Beast Balls for nothing. You would think the Beast Balls would be instant, but they don't seem to work like that. I feel like a Beast Beast Ball is like a Master Ball, but for the Ultra Dimension. All right, we're bringing in Metagross for the fight. Let's go with the Meteor Mash. Oh, chill, my guy. No need to one-shot me like that. Going in with Garchomp. Let's use Santom. I'm asleep. Great. You know what? Let me just not waste my time. I got you. Let me just Ultra Ball. I'll just pull a Jamie and throw a Master Ball. Uh, yep. Yo, I got it. Let's go. And there we have it. Here is my Zerg Tree. It's got Beast Boost. It's a Lightning type, Thunder Wave, Ingrained Hypnosis, and that's the nature. And apparently, this is a Runt size. I can't even imagine this thing ginormous. Around size, what? That's what I'm saying, bro. From days 1383 to 1388, as we were building our fishing dock, a Zamazenta spawned. Connor, check if the Zamazenta is a shiny, okay? All right, I'm gonna look to find it. Now, here's what I'm thinking. So, let's get rid of all the trees in this specific area, Ooh, and let's make it all me. into... It's shiny! What? It's shiny. Where? The Zamazenta. What are you talking about? Is that it? It's shiny. Oh, it is a shiny. It is a shiny. It's oh, it's let's go, baby. Let's go. First is Aishan, now the shiny Zamazenta. Crazy. For the first try, is there... No, it's that's not our first try. No. Okay. Uh, dang it. Do you want to catch it? I'm trying to. I'm trying to finish up this uh, fishing rod. Yeah, I can The fishing dock. Okay. So here's what we're thinking. You know, fishing out there was kind of boring. So we decided, why not make our very own fishing dock inside here? I like this it's idea. A, it's a little bit it's small. Most of the time. That's the only thing I'm worried about. By the way, like it's, it's a little bit small. So I feel like it's not gonna work. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like with all the big Pokemon that spawn in there, it's just gonna mess it up. But get rid of Honestly, every single regular yeah. tree around here. It has to be only palm trees. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I get are you catching it, or you want me to master ball it? I'm trying to catch it. If you want to master ball it, go ahead. Okay, I'll master ball. I got He's you. Not trying to get my ultra Here, Jamie, ball. just clear why. out all these yeah. trees, okay? And I'm try to like ball. separate them with about like a five block or like a three to five block radius, or else okay. they won't work. Got Where's you. my boy? Where's my He's boy, right Zamazenta? He's right here. Where's he? I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Yay! Um, did it work? Did you get him? No, I went through him. No way. You lost the master ball? No, I, I didn't lose it. I actually have it, but it's not working. Yeah, he wasn't working. Oh, it's either. working. It's working. It's got it. I got it. Let's go! Yo, now that is what I call a crazy find. And here is my shiny Zamazenta. There we go, Zamazenta and shiny Zacian. Look at this, my boy. Yeah, they look so at whoa. beautiful. Wow. Like Bond Candy. So a giant Bond Bond Candy, is Bond way Candy. bigger, bro. Look at this thing. And here is the crown forms or whatever they're called. I don't know. It's like the uh, like the ultimate form of it. There you go. Yeah, yeah. How cool is this? Oh, she's so beautiful. Cool. I love that one. Now yeah. comment down yeah. below. Are you a Zamazenta or a Zacian? Fan. Fan? I think I'm fan. Uh, <laughs> That's what 40 hours of Pokemon like... gets you. You can't even speak English no more. I don't know. I like the I like the Zamazenta. Here's the Ooh, stats yeah, for Zamazenta, yeah. by the way. It's got Dauntless Shield, boost of Pokemon's defense that when the Pokemon enters the battle. Uh, it doesn't have Pokerus. These are the attacks, and it's a lax nature, huge, and these are the uh, you know, it's increased defense and decreased special defense. So pretty cool Pokemon, I gotta say. I'm pretty sure when I I think I played Pokemon Shield instead of Sword. I totally forgot, bro. Alright, so everything is looking pretty solid. And there we have it. 
all the palm trees are looking fire and let's create the pathway to the fishing dock and now it feels a lot better i feel like the other fishing dock we have is more of like a um kind of like decoration you know what i mean with yeah, like the beach like, area and stuff but this yeah. is like this is still pretty cool you know the only thing we're missing are like these little reeds everywhere um which yeah this should be good so jamie how, how about we test it out let's go ahead and test it out with the fishing house let's see what we get everybody come on board and let's see what we got boom can we catch a special magic carp or any pokemon in general i think it should work i don't know it's not working might have to be deeper Mine oh oh hey, you got I it good. i got a special one no way no way yo oh, what i got a great one i got a great dude, one dude jamie's got so much good luck bro okay so it works that's a good thing so since we did get a shiny zamazenta i kind of feel like i'm obligated to put it on my pokemon team i just gotta do it it's like only necessary you know what i mean so we're gonna swap out my agron um with my zamazenta from days 1389 to 1399 we started building the interior of the castle so we started labeling every single section for what we're gonna build all right team are you ready to make this place look fabulous i saw yeah. the comments everyone's like moose you've never worked in the house i know i know we haven't worked on it at all i think yeah. it's like long overdue we've done it in every single one of our all the haunted days except this one so uh jamie's already to get the little couch set up going here oh wow that's pretty cool yeah. i like it and we're keeping the view i like the view especially because you have like the you know the cathedral castle flying thing whatever you want to call that uh the yeah. floating pokemon statue thing and then um yep. we can keep our equipment in here so let's say for example like furnaces you know what i mean and we can also keep our pokemon stuff like the training machines now for our fridge we'll keep it in the kitchen of course so we'll put like right here for example i do want to do a double fridge um and this can be the dining table so we can take out the middle pillar and i guess yep. connor can like fix it up here and we also need like a laundry room so i think like this can be the laundry room like something like this here. I don't know what we're gonna do with a mower, but I guess we'll just we'll just keep random mo mower in the laundry room. I don't know yeah. why. You know, just casual mower right there. Or I don't know. Okay, a vibe, maybe. <laughs> it's it's definitely interesting. We'll just keep the mower here. Now for our fan, we can probably put this like some up oh, my Jamie. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> we can put a fan right here. It's kind of cool. Like on the windowsill. Um, and we can put one on top of the washing machine. And I think we can probably close this off as well. So let's make a door. And then this is going to be for the actual laundry room. So we'll get rid of this. Make a laundry room set up here. All right. Something like this. And then turn it into like an actual room. There we go. Connor, what do you think? I'm liking it. Yeah. Like it? Yeah. I don't know what this is. I, I don't know. I'm trying, to make a, I'm trying to make a laundry room. You want to help me out with it? Yeah. Is, that, is that how we're going to... I don't think it doesn't make any sense. Yeah, you know. And then you go like this. The wood just doesn't match. So that's the only no, 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 issue. Take, I don't know. Take, take, Try take, to, off the, here, take off the Here. Make stuff. it look good. Make it look good. You got it. You got okay, it, bro. Okay. <laughs> Jamie, what are you doing Hi. down there? Uh, yeah, so what I'm, is this? Uh, yeah, I'm not too sure what this is, but I found it. You like it? It's cool. It, yeah, it is cool. Can we, can we like have something. like a secret entrance here? I like this. Yeah, me too. That's what exactly what I was thinking. Here, I put the trap door down. Now we just need ladders. Okay. Here, let me uh here's a carving type. I have, I have stick. I have sticks. Okay. Okay. You want to make ladders? Maybe not. I do. Really? Okay. Good job. <laughs> I don't think we need 36, but I made 36. Oh, you already made some. That's okay. <laughs> Dude, I just made some more sticks. So I'm gonna be turning the chests into actual storage bins. So something like this. Uh, I just need trap chests for this one. And then we'll do like this. Let's see if they trap chest over there. Uh, we need some sort of a slab set up. And here's what we're doing here. So upside down like this. Okay, it looks kind of interesting. Oh, so I don't know about his design, but... Oh, man, that looks weird. Yeah, that looks weird. I don't like that. Yo, Why this is place is so big, by the way. You know we can make this into like a studio? Do, should we do that? Let's make it into a studio. And we can have like bookshelves on the top floor. Okay, now this is a pretty solid design. All right, so now watch this. We are ready to make some art. So, Connor, the only thing we're missing is trap chest here. All right, this is all good. Now, watch this. Watch the flow. Here we go. Trash can. All right. So let's put another trash can here. All right. Now these are good. Um, I said we add in an anvil. Get rid of this one. I don't like this one at all. Okay. Let's push these forward. Push your coffee tables forward. All right. Boom. Boom. Anvil. Anvil. Okay. And we could even have like a little hanging thing down here. Uh, or we could put like street lights or something. Like a lamp. I don't know. Oh, that'd be cool. That'd be cool. Uh, yeah. We'll, we'll figure that out after. The small details will be after. Now, over here, let's do a trading machine. Right here in the center. Oh, wrong spot. Right there. Trading machine. Okay. We're going to put one healer on both sides. And then in this corner, I was thinking of making an actual way to go upstairs. What are you guys thinking? Like a way to get up there. And we like a little yeah. bookshelf set up there. So, okay, let's see. Now, fossil this place. Here, Jamie, you want to work on the second floor up here? So maybe we can like create like a little ladder or like a staircase. Totally up to you guys. Now, this is going to go here. The fossil this place. We're going to put one fossil here. All right. Close it up. Here's another one. Close it up. Now we are sitting with three anvils. All right, now for the anvils, they're a little tricky. So we're gonna stack them like this. All right, trying to think. Now we have an infuser too. So let's move this out of the way. We can turn this into the infusing station. All right, and this is a tough one. I don't know how to decorate this one, honestly. What if I put the mechanical... Nope, looks weird. Instead, in this section, I'll put the mechanical anvil with the fuser, healer's check, add a spruce bench set up here. All right, same goes for here. Now, I like the trees. I like the trees a lot. We can put them in the center like this, next to the benches. All right, so if you have any more trees, Connor, like, you know, line it up. Laundry room check, dining table check, game is working. 
working on that. So go to the second floor. Jamie's already finished it up. And I want to squeeze in an enchanting table set up here. So I don't really have one yet. Idea. So I definitely need one. We can do it like this. I have an idea actually. I've done this before in my old builds. Yes, I have a pretty good one. Watch this. So perfect. I'm over here. Fill it in. Alright. And then we'll put the enchanting table here. We'll kind of like divide it a little bit. And we can use this as a computer setup. And normally by putting like a oh, I just fell on the floor. <laughs> Alright, so this jungle leaves. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. And then we need anvil with wait for it. Chest, flower pots for the jukeboxes. I mean the note blocks. Okay. We got yep. a red tulip cactus. Alright. I'm feeling the vibe. I'm feeling the vibe. I like it. I okay. like it. Okay. Alright, I think that's about it for this floor. Um I like bookshelf. It. Like that. Really like Ooh, it. yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like the vibe. There we go. And uh how's downstairs? Ooh! I like that. That's cool. We should make this into like a lamp, like a chandelier. Chandelier! You know? This is good. Yeah, let me Cauldrons. see. Cauldrons. So we're missing one thing here. Like, do you like this though? Or do you like this design more? Nah. Look at it. it. So if you right click this one, oh. Okay. But we can like fill it up here like this. This is kind of cool. Yeah, something like this. It's interesting. I, like it. I don't know. I, I feel like we maxed it out. I mean, it looks it looks great. Uh, yeah, I think you know? I think we maxed it out. It looks pretty good. Like we just need some it carpet. Does. Connor's room is really basic. Connor Ooh, needs some things for his room. My room looks yeah. pretty solid. Um the no, kitchen no. is not done yet. I'm still thinking of some ideas. Patio needs some work in Jamie's room. Jamie's room is already like perfected. Yeah, I love my room. There you go. Just two more plants. Enjoy. <laughs> All right, not bad. We have two options. Trap doors or pressure plates. Ah, I like the trap doors. Trap doors work. Yeah, me too. And then too. crafting table with the pressure plate on top. All right, and now we got to put the sink in here. Ooh, that's tricky. What if we move it over here and then we add something like this? And now we talking. Okay, that kind of flows. That's not that bad at all. I don't know. What do you think? Yeah. No, not bad. It's not bad. Or honestly, I say we just move it over here. This makes more sense. Yeah, sink should just be here. I don't know. And then we'll get rid of this. We'll make this into like a crafting table set up right here. And it's going to be like a quadruple still set up. Boom. There we go. A lot of burgers on there. Yeah, you're making a lot of burgers, my guy. There we have it. Jamie, do you have any water on you? Um, yeah, actually, I do. Yeah, bucket get of water. water yeah. Quick. yeah, just a bucket yeah. of water. Mm, I'm gonna put the trash can right here. Yo, this looks sick. I also put a bucket really cool. of lava. Here you go. Yo, no okay, way. Okay, I'm gonna put the. I'm guessing putting the water. Yeah, in yeah put, put it. Give me that one job. Um, 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 um. Oh, um. Okay. You wanna give me the bucket? Yeah. Here you go. Pick it up. Oh, oops. oops. <laughs> <laughs> I had one job. I'm definitely that meme. <laughs> you got one job. <laughs> Yo, put the, put the, the lever down. You had the lever as well. Oh, that okay. So that's probably what happened. Let's show something. Here you go. I'm just gonna give it to you. I don't want to mess it up. I'm scared. Bye. <laughs> All right, that's that's it. That's got to be it. If you really want, we can put a fan in the corner, but like th that's it, bro. Like I'm telling you, this looks Dude, crazy. I love this. I love this so much. We did a phenomenal job on the entire thing. Now y'all can't wow. be telling us that, you know, we didn't work on the interior. <laughs> no, this is like insane. And the final part is going to be the patio. So if y'all want to do the patio, I'll do the computer room upstairs, okay? Okay. Okay. All right, let me show you how it's done. Okay, boom, fan over there. First, we need uh, coarse pillars. Boom, check. Okay, now we're going to do a double or set it like this, all right? So like this, okay, like this, and like that. All right, now we can also close off the center. Oh, I broke something. That's it. That's gonna be the design. So I was thinking like this. So either three of these, or we can change like the middle of it. All right, and then have like something like this. Then we'll put a clock on top. We can add a white vending machine in the corner here. All right. Uh, I guess this fan kind of becomes useless, but we could put like that. Or we can do TV. Eh, that's kind of strange. So we just do the fan. And then we need black chairs. All right. And now we're gonna do two white couches here, like this. All right, are we talking? And that's that's kind of about it for the second floor. That's it's a really simple setup. It works. That's a little bit better. There we go. Small little details, and we're good. I'm also excited this out. Add some glowstone, and that's about it. Now here's what it looks like from downstairs. Pretty solid design, and you can't even tell there's a secret gaming setup up there. Whoa, the patio! You like it? That's creative. That's I, I know what she did there. That's creative. I like that. I like that. I feel like you kind of need like a little camping site here, but uh, perfect. This, this is amazing. I love it. The castle looks gorgeous, bro. And now we just gotta get rid of all. All these random banners. And I think 1400. I gave my shiny Zabazenta, Dynamax Candy, and then leveled them up. All right, my friend, we gotta get you some. Uh, oh, I guess you can't really learn anything. I'll put the howl on him, though. And we're still missing one more thing the Behemoth Blade. Now, let's put a rusted shield back on this guy. All right. And now we just gotta max out all of its stats. So we're gonna go for a adamant attack. So we're turning this dude into a physical attacker. All right. So we got all this. There we go. And let me give him all that. There we go. And now let's give this dude as many levels possible. 
And then we're gonna test out just how strong a maxed out Zamazenta is. All right, my boy. We got you. Let's go. All right, he's level 95, 96, 97, 98. Let's see if we can actually take on these Pokemon right here. A hey, shiny Geodude. Let's use close combat. Oh, I mean, that is a Geodude, though. Don't forget, that's just a Geodude. So yeah, I don't know how strong easy. this guy is. Yeah, just yet. Got a rare candy. Now, how does he do up against a camera? Let's find out. Close combat. Ooh, he's, he's, he's doing up. Oh, nope, he's dead. He's too squishy. <laughs> and let's finish it off. Level 100. Yo, yes. my boy is stacked. All right. Yeah, the texture is crazy. We're still so missing cool. one attack, by the way. We need Behemoth Blade. Uh, okay. So we have a 400 attack. Wait, 394 attack base. Groudon is still stronger. I don't know what to tell you. He's way faster, though. His defense and special defense is pretty good. His health is pretty solid. But Groudon is still just overall stronger Pokemon, in my opinion. Now, if we put him into the crown form, he does get stronger, though. He does have... 394. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's not bad. 266 attack. I don't know. It's not that bad at all. All right, Zamazenta's ready to go. I also taught a Behemoth Bash, and that's about it. I just don't have a uh, PP up, but uh, that's no big deal. All right, so try do whatever you can, Connor. You got this. Okay. okay? Going, I'm gonna I'm try going, a certain going strategy. Now, Connor has all. Oh, he's, oh, you're pumping the defense. Ah, that's a bad idea, my guy. Bad idea, bro. Oh man, Connor doesn't know how to play the game. Oh, no, no, man. I'm getting. Get As I say that, and I use a non-effective attack. Oh, all right, no, it's useless. <laughs> like, what? You gotta be kidding me. I did use the wrong attack. Don't get me wrong. But still, it should not be getting one shot like that. Yo, that Necrozma's defense kind of did go up. Yo, what? Yo, get out of here, bro. It is going crazy. I honestly forgot what type of what type of Pokemon Necrozma is. I think it's just like a dark no. type. Bro, this is the ground beef. You messing with ground beef, bro. Ground beef got sweet. All right. Oh, that's the wrong Pokemon. My bad. <laughs> I used the wrong attack. But still, ground beef got sweet for your whole Pokemon team. <laughs> All right, we're doing a rematch. Was well, Zamazenta, okay? Oh, I mean, I don't know, dude. It's like, he's got it. But, like, he doesn't got it. You know what I mean? Oh, the water gun. Not the water gun, bro. <laughs> Yo, you ready for this one shot? I'm, oh, I'm burning. I'm burning. I'm wall charging. Yay, bro, come on. You can't even yes! one shot. Nah, nah, bro. I'm done. I'm done. Was well, Zamazenta. Oh, no, Everyone in the comments, be like, beat, that's the beat. wrong strategy, bro. That's the wrong strategy. Trust me, I'm done. This shit oh. was fire, but this guy, oh. not it. Get this Rayquaza out of my face once and for all, bro. No, bro, that man. Thing is what? Sweeps, bro. Yo, dude, it just oh, sweeps. Oh. Sweeps, yo. Like, literally, I haven't played Pixelmon in a while. No. And when I did stop my season of Pixelmon, I was using ground beef. And I'm back, and I'm still using ground beef. Like, come I on, know. Man. I like it. I tried to replace it with a Rayquaza. Still ain't cutting it, honestly. Ooh, this is a tough one. I honestly don't remember what type he is. <laughs> I was like, I have no idea, but I'm just gonna one shot him. I got you. Last one. Last one. Yeah. Cool. And I'm gone. And I'm gone. Yep. Everybody, yep. Oh and subscribe yep. button if you enjoyed this video. And make sure you enable all notifications. And don't forget to click this plus right over here. You have to click. It's all my Pokemon videos. You don't want to miss it. And I will see you in the next Pokemon video.